Hello friends, it's August 6, 2019, another beautiful day on this blue planet. Hope you're doing well. Most of you probably know what's going on with the disputed region of Kashmir. It's one of those sensitive trouble regions between India and Pakistan. Just two days ago, just two days ago, Indian government revoked a special status enjoyed by Kashmiri region for more than 70 years now. Now I'm not going to talk about um, what this special status was or the history of this region and all those details because uh, it takes a lot of time and it will take a separate video. But I'm going to talk about this news channel called Al Jazeera English and how it's lying about this whole situation. Look, you may like India's decision, you may support it, or you may oppose it. That's fine. But you should not lie and twist facts in this process. And I think that's exactly what Al Jazeera is doing here. Just a few minutes ago, I watched this report on Al Jazeera English channel and the title says, Indians divided over Kashmir. That's a complete lie. That title, you know, kind of saying that the Indians are divided over this Kashmir is a total lie. In fact, Indians are overwhelmingly supporting central government decision to revoke the special status to Kashmir. That's because you know, again, I don't want to get into these details, but overall there is this feeling in majority of India's population that Kashmir has been going on for too long. We have tried for too long to settle this issue, but there is no progress here and it's time to make a bold decision. So majority of India's population, overwhelming majority of the population, plus the political parties are supporting central government, India's decision to revoke the special status. Yes, of course there is a small section within India who have opposed this decision, mainly on the political and religious lines. Because if you go and ask uh, uh, probably Indian Muslim population, uh, there is a good chance that most of them would oppose it. And there is no surprise in that. But by no means you cannot characterize this as a divided India. In fact, it's a united India when it comes to this particular Kashmir decision. It's very misleading, as if there is a sizable population or there is a big percentage of population opposing it. It's a total lie. So this title is very misleading. It's not a divided India. In fact, it's a united India when it comes to this particular decision. The same report, okay, this is funny. The same report shows two Kashmiri students, one man and one woman, uh, expressing their fear and frustrations or India's crackdown in Kashmir region. Look, that's fine. They have the right to express their opinion. Um, that's their right. I got no problems with that. And if you look at their names, these two these students are from Kashmir and both are Muslims. It's quite clear. But the funny thing is the report says that woman is a Kashmiri Hindu. If you don't believe me, I'm providing the screenshot here. You can see that. You can see her name. You can see her picture. She's wearing this hijab or whatever it's called, the head covering. And you know that she is a Muslim. But the report shows that she is a Kashmiri Hindu. Now, I will let you decide if the channel is misleading or lying to its audience. It's quite clear. My job is to present the facts here. Look, man, I'm perfectly all right if you don't agree with this India's decision. Okay, you may be on one side or the other. That's all fine. But what's not acceptable is trying to lie about the situation and misrepresenting things. That's not good because that's how you would lose your credibility and nobody would take you seriously. And that's exactly what Al Jazeera did just now by lying about situation.